Yes. Yeah, package deal. Yo, All right, two for one special. All right. Um, all right, the third close this one out uh, with the Jets. Uh, you know, that big drive here in the fourth quarter, both y'all had some plays in that. I mean, he the one scores, so I think he should answer that. I mean, man, it feels good, man. Like I said, man, this guy here, man, is the playmaker, so I'm just trying to be like him when I grow up. <laughs> Chill out. Right, y'all get the uh, 23 lead, but how, what did you say about the team that y'all, you know, fought, fought as they tried to get back in it and, and pulled out the win here today? At the end of the day, we got the win. That's all that matters. We don't care if we won by one point or 100 points. Our whole mindset was just, just coming and get a win and going to the bye week, and that's what we did. How did you rate the Tottenham experience? This is my third time here, so it's fun. I love it. I want to come back every week. <laughs> uh, I love it, too. This is my third time as well, but every offseason I come here, so I love London. Mike, what did you guys end up doing last night, and what did the uh, Bills take back for dinner? Ooh. Uh, <laughs> to, to be truthful, um, we we ended up at a spot. Uh, we ended up at Five Guys. I was supposed to pay for everything, but they had already paid for theirs. So hey, when Mike say he paying for something, do not believe it because <laughs> he 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 never pays. I took them boys to Roof Chris. So <sighs> that's like McDonald's, man. Ooh, that's how you know he got money. <laughs> Honestly, man, it's, it, I mean we all know what Kyle can do. You know, and like Coach always say, he, is, he, he expects stuff like that from Cal, and we do too. You know, I mean, he was the fourth overall pick. You know, it's, it's nothing shy of that. You know, he got every, he got every asset. You know, he, he, he got good speed, hands, routes, you know, and, you know, and stuff like that happen to Cal. You know, we, we want it to happen every week. And we just, we just proud of the guy he's, he's been coming each and every week. He, he's doing everything he can. You know, it, it's a lot on his plate. You know, but, you know, it, it comes with the territory. So, you know, we always got his back. You know, we support him, and we just hope he keep continue to doing that. You said you've now been to London, uh, like as many as three times. Have you been able to soak up any of the big sports here in England, uh, football or soccer? We haven't. You know, they, they every time we get here, they never give us time to do anything. So, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's always the coach's fault when we get here. So, they, we got to blame them for not giving us a lot of time to go watch it. No. No. Heck no. Heck no. 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 <laughs> I'll it. Ain't no bowl game. <laughs> no. Coming here a few times. The NFL maybe start moving to Germany maybe for next year and maybe other other countries around Europe then. How do you feel about that? And are you, you know, does it make you proud that the American game is going international global like this? And is it something you'd like to play or any other countries you'd like to play? That'd be lit. <laughs> that'd be really lit. Um, I, I really think that'd be fun. Uh, like, you know what I mean? Players really love coming to London. Uh, I think we're playing in uh, Mexico City as well. Um, so for us to get a game in Germany, that'd be like a great experience. Any other countries you want to play in? Every country. It should be a, a different game every week in a different country. If we could play a, can, a game in Turks and Caicos, I'm pretty sure CP would love that. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Any more questions? Yes. Uh, what do you make of the UK-based fans? Oh, it was it was awesome out there, man. I, you know, I was out there earlier, you know, throwing throwing the football and staying with everybody, and it's probably my best crowd in the hat. You know, <laughs> everybody was excited. So you know, and when they doing stuff like that, it just making my job more easier for me. Yeah, sixty-five thousand fans. Yeah, that's that's insane. It was sixty-five. It was sixty-five thousand. Guys, I wonder if you have any, any thoughts on uh, John Green's uh, recent comments. You saw those. Uh, you might call me back up. They, I don't think we know what that is. Yeah, I, I, I haven't seen. I don't know. Yeah, I can give you a comment on that because I don't know you what. Interesting. Yeah, yeah I, I can't tell you how. Do we have time for one more question? Anybody? <laughs> That's tough. Yeah. I mean, I mean, uh, how, how good are we going into this break with the, with the you know, positive uh, spin on getting the win and, you know, then, you know, get back to work good and we'll later on, I guess. Later on. Honestly, you know, I know for me and Mike, you know, it's, 
it's really in the bye week. You know, we, we're going to go get our body work, bodies worked on, you know, working out when we go back home and stuff like that. So you can say a bye week, but it's, it, it's still been it's still, it's, it's, it's still a long season. So we, we still got to make sure our bodies stay in shape and you can't take no days off. I mean, you need that rest, but at the end of the day, you know, we all grown and, you know, we, we all know what we need for our bodies. So we got to go in and just, just get our bodies worked on. Awesome. Thanks, you guys. Thank you all. Right. Cheers. 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 Cheers.